Welcome back, everybody. Time to lock down some popper slivers. We're playing Gustavo Lilia, which, I don't know, the name sounds familiar. We might have gone against him one time. Uh, this is a keepable hand. A little bit slow with the Blossoming Sands, but we've got our plays. Let's see, black? Hmm. I'm gonna lead with Blossoming so we can do a Benevolent Bodyguard into Viverlin play. Or even Benevolent Bodyguard into Plated, just depending on what they're rocking here. Alright, so they're gonna cycle. Alright, what are you playing out? Okay, draw those cards. I'm gonna get my board established over here. Another Blossoming. Uh, yeah, I think we are going to... Let's see. What's the best way to do this here? I'm trying to make sure I can get stuff out of range. I think we'll just do the Viverlins. Get some Edict Protection too. The benefit of playing two creatures in one turn. Just in case that we're going up against Mono Black Control, which it looks like we might be. Sign in Blood. They play with that card. This turn will be very telling. If we can draw into a Plains, that'd be, that'd be nice too. An untapped Plains. Drop a Plated and a Sinew or something like that. Really start getting these guys out of range. Sure. And there it is. Dead weight. So you're gonna you're gonna double up on me here. It's either I try to protect and lose this one, or I allow this and they go for this one anyways. It seems like they have another one in their hand. I'm gonna let this happen. They're playing patient, which is fine. Let's go ahead and... I think we're just gonna play Spinneret. I got pr uh, plenty of lands, that's for sure. I'm gonna sign in blood again. Sure, I'll take out the spinneret. All right, well. Is it time to drop the sinew and the sentinel? Might be. Seems reasonable. Mm, actually, no. I think I'm going to drop the sinew and the plated. Get them out of reach of the negative two, negative two at least. Oh, I didn't attack it with my benevolent. That's okay. If I lose by missing one point on them, it'll be because of that. Okay, Kumbo Witches. And we seen another creature here. Crypt Rats. Okay, we need some removal for that thing. ASAP. We don't get it. So all these creatures are gonna die. Which is unfortunate.
So I'm not going to play anything. I get to choose once. I'm gonna shoot my life. Uh, you're gonna do that. I was wondering if you're trying to do this. I would like to sacrifice him at least. Now, Crip Raps. Is this the play? I don't even know if protecting him will save him from Crip Raps. I, I don't think it will. Honestly. Looks like they're gonna just do it now, which is smart. Kinda wanna know if that would actually work though. happened there? Did they mess that up? Said they paid zero for it? What? <laughs> okay. I don't know what happened there. But yep. That'll happen. That'll happen and that'll happen. Yeah, tap out. That's good. Yeah, that's unfortunate. But, uh, we can still rebuild. A oh, non-creature. Oh yeah, so they bust. Alright, that's fine then. Forgot that it was non-creature. Such a... I don't like that artwork. Oh, and Crypt Rats. Wow. That's stupid. Well, I'm not gonna play anything. You just got me locked. I need uh, some kind of removal here. Ah, uh, that sucks. I need this card draw. just put something out. A nice 2-2. Two -two, just to see if they want to get rid of it. I'm going to try it. I don't mind losing the Sentinel if they want to crack the Crypt Rats just on that thing. But this is all I'm going to play. I can at least swing into these. But... Ugh. Chittering Rats again? Are you kidding me? I just want... A chance to remove your stupid crypt traps. Come on, there we go. That's annoying. Not a black control for ya. Could really bait. We could bait it a lot more. I don't know if I want to sweeten the deal by putting plated down. We could try. I just I don't know how necessary it is. Gotta try something. They're not letting me draw cards, so maybe I can at least tempt them. So much mana! Uh oh, it's a lot of mana. You got a Gurmog? Ooh, yuck. Am I dead here? They have a lot of black devotion. I go to 10, okay. Still kind of possible to come back for this. We 
You really doing that attack? What do you got in your hand here? I'm gonna take this. Vines, huh? So I can play a Lord and then Vines it and then have two Lords on the battlefield and they will have nothing. They're gonna have to crack it for four, everything will die. But my Predatory will survive. Sure. I should have attacked in there. I don't know why I didn't. I'm too concerned about this Crypt Rat. Stupid rat trouble I'm having. Uh -huh. I think I'm just going to block two. Do they have another Gary? If they have another Gary, we are dead either way. Okay, they're gonna do this. Okay. All right, cause we get hit too. That's right. Yeah, I forgot we get hit. Oh well, let's go to game two. Yeah, we, we were screwed either way. I mean, we're at two life. That's pretty hard to recover from. Uh, I forgot that hit us too, though. Oh well. Oh, what do we need? Sunlance. Another journey. Gut shot. Relic. Just all the tools. Oh, man. Maybe we don't need as many journeys. We don't need spinnerets. We could probably drop one winding. Well, actually, refilling our hand against Mono Black is pretty good. We need to cut four cards. I guess we can drop our sentinels. I want to keep all my one drops, honestly. Maybe we're going too removal heavy. I don't know. They have a lot of problems, though. Need our protection. Maybe we'll just do one relic. Cuts. Cut one Sunlance. Sunlance can hit the rats, but they've already damage done and most of the other stuff. Yeah, I guess Sunlance really isn't that strong. Gutshot will take out the witches, it'll take out the Crypt Rat, it will take out. Uh, that's about it, but those are the major problems. Sunlance won't hit Gary. Uh, journeys can take care of the Crypt Rats, so... Does this look okay? Maybe, maybe we want the other journey and just take out our other Sentinel. Like that. 26 creatures, 14 spells. Let's try it. Well, mm, it's not a bad hand. It's really not. 
It's just not like there's no we we have no answers to those things. We'll keep it. We can refill at least. We'll do a uh, blossoming sands first again. We'll take that line. And then we can drop a Sidewinder on Viverland. It'll give us one more chance to maybe draw into like a Benevolent or uh, some kind of other protection spell. I could just drop a Viverland uh, or a Sidewinder and hold on to something, but mm, let's just go ahead and drop these two. Removal is coming. Removal, removal, removal. Then creatures, creatures, creatures. Yep. You got one more of those? No? Okay. Ugh. It's not pretty. Yeah, that's winding away. I need to get some more uh, bait for all this removal. <sighs> we just get another sinew. That's bad. What did we lose? Just lands. Okay. Lands are, are somewhat useful too, but I think there's other things that we could be getting that'll be helpful. Goomba witches. Okay. Oh, I thought they were 1-1s. One -ones. So Gutshot doesn't even hit these. For some reason, I was thinking they were 1-1s. One -ones. All right, let's start dropping some more stuff. Get in for a little bit of damage. Take our lord. And then they're gonna ping our flanking. That's not fun. Can I choose them? What? If I can hit them. I guess I didn't realize that. I, every time we gone against my back control, we just dealt with this before it even had a chance to like go off. Which is funny. Okay. Gosh dang it. So many lords. We just need another forest so we can start protecting them. best to just get rid of our winding way hold on to our creatures that's eh, toss up and now now we get it wow all right they got one card left in hand let's see what they can do with it Ugh, Gary. Yuck. Alright, we're just gonna keep doing this game plan. <clears throat> I 
Good, they drew another land. What do they got? Another Gary? Holy cow. That's crazy. If they're smart, they'd attack in. Yep. And we have to take it. Otherwise, they'll shoot down one of our muscle slivers. Or one of our lords. We keep drawing it. We keep drawing right. But man, oh man. This is just problematic. Can we afford to be on the crack back here? Barely. Swing with one, just in case. Have our blockers up. Our life is pretty low. So you're dealing one damage to this, and then what? Okay. Interesting. I don't know what the point of that was, but all right. Can I be the target? Can I? Can I be the one? Can I do this against myself, please? That sucks. Good game. Good game. It was a tough matchup. They had really good hands. Three Garys. Can't do anything about that. Can't do anything about that. Oh, well. Hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, watching a little bit of misplays with the Kumba Witches. <laughs> I didn't know I could ping them instead of myself. I didn't know it was my choice. It's hilarious. But three Garys. Come on. Can't beat three Garys. That's just hard. That's harsh. But leave a like on the video. Make sure to subscribe for more Popper Sliver. Stay tuned. We're going to have some more Call of Duty coming up tomorrow. And by this time, I'm recording in advance, but uh, I'm sure we've had uh, some live streams, maybe, of Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying those. And, uh, yes, more this weekend and some booster cracking on Sunday, so stay tuned, and we will see you guys in the next video.